Hey everybody, Teacher Plays back at it with more Rogue Trader. Hope you're enjoying it so far. We are currently exploring the system of Renatos. If you remember, we had a space battle last time. Uh, now we're going to check these planets out. Maybe take another space battle, see what's what. So, just kind of floating around, exploring. I'm really enjoying this section of the game. Uh, I don't know why. I don't even know if I have any extractors. We don't, okay. Desert world. Down here. Like a death world or something. Not sure exactly what. I appreciate that there are ones that have... Uh, let's go explore this one. Oh, you're going close to the sun. I really like the open exploration thing where it doesn't lock you into uh, on land for so long. I need more uh, distractums. All right, let's get into combat. See what we got. But just a fantastic game. It, sorry, I'm rearranging myself. Uh, it could easily be. This void ship will oh, not be defeated. Dark Eldar. Um. Fire torpedoes. Okay. Um. Do anything with my prow. Like here. Shoot. Bring those down. To our enemies. Okay, that didn't do anything. Interesting. Here's the issue because I go that way. Shoot it. That. Interesting. They're gonna hit me right away, probably. The dorsal cannons. Do anything that's just fire my torpedoes Great do what they can do destruction upon our enemies uh, oh i not hey. bad start Um, yeah, what I was saying before is these guys could be definitely considered the game could be in the pantheon of best Warhammer games. I've given them my rear, which is not good. Um, pivot the torpedoes here so they have kind of a two-way go to see where they go. Smart, just out of my range. Try to avoid the set course with all haste. <laughs> I'm not good at the space combat. I still have to say, Dawn of War 2 is probably my favorite. Oh, jeez. Coming right at me. Perfect for us. Hopefully I can get my torpedoes in there. Get them up. <laughs> Punks! Um... I go oh, wait. probably 
not. Let me get this one in my sights. But I should be too close to those torpedoes for them to turn right into me. I would think. Unleash the power of our dance Oh, he missed. Okay. Oh, okay, no. They hit my rear. Interesting. What are they doing? I'm gonna be able to ram them. Deliver their demise! They missed, though. Ram. Can't ram him. Okay. Here. Hold on him. And I should be able to hit him with my dorsal scoop. Beauty. And are these still a threat if they're not? I want to go forward. Oh, nah, that's stupid. We do that. Let's see if we, we can have turn a that destination down. to reach. I mean, ultimately, they're not a, like they won't do too much damage, but I'd like to avoid them uh, lighting me up. Navigate us to the Super interesting, I know everybody. I'm gonna wait till they burn out. Yeah, there we go. Another victory for the oh, Imperium Mankind. Well, I don't know about that. I don't think we're technologically advanced in the Eldari. Alright, let's check the last world. Like a hive city. Monastery of the Order of the Hammer. That's cool. Lord Captain, we have received a transmission from Fellstone. Sent by members of Order of the Hammer, votaries of St. Cognatius, whose monastery is the only settlement on the planet. Or rather, it used to be some time ago a transport vessel, the Navilica, unloaded several thousand refugees from the planet belonging to Rogue Trader Winterscale. The Order of the Hammer has judged these, this invasion to be an act of aggression and is asking for your lordship's protection. Um... People are victims, not inv invaders. Prepare my shuttle as it pleases you. Okay, cool. So we got to talk. Six score and eleven days after the feast of the passing of Nicomatis Keith, champion of the faith, disquietude marred the calm monastery of the Order of the Hammer. Countless tortured souls, deep in fear, arrived on Falstor and in the star Starbark. A great apostasy has befallen their home and turned them into abject wanderers seeking help of refuge. Their wicked and cruel captain, the owner of the Navika, had betrayed them once the unknowing souls in his care. Uh, he most deviously recalled his shuttles and left, thus ridding himself of his duty of care to the unfortunate. Not knowing how they would survive in Foulstone's grim wastelands, the forsaken people came to the monasteries of St. Cognitius, and there they surrounded its walls. They hammered their fists on the gates, implored and wailed, take us in, protect us. And what once was a place of serenity and grace was now full of din, disorder, and all manner of things despicable. The interlopers brought with them worldly futility and strife, and mayhap also the seeds of alluring blasphemy. If fiendly heathens lurked in their midst. After a prayer, the prelate Hectarchius turned his eyes to the past. Church of Instruction. Uh, prelate, eight, prelate H. Uh, recalled the first missionaries to set foot on Faustus Vasilis, and led by their veal for serving St. Cognatius. These missionaries had received the blessing of Nicomedes' key. Champion of the faith who had traveled with them in their starbark to found its place, humble and pure beyond wherein cultivate wisdom and purity. And Saint Cognatius, a man of great endeavors, a warrior and a wise artificer, never cowered behind the walls of a librarian, but stepped bravely into the dark, carrying the light in the palm of his hand. And not only Falstone, but many other worlds of the Cronus expanse bear its imprint. And Prelate Hectus did welcome the interlopers warmly as his guests, and he did warn his brethren to keep their vigilance. Oh my god, I'm not even making choices. The brethren and sisters of the Holy Order of the Hamel came forth to meet strangers carrying water and protein, victuals, and medicinal herbs and chubs for Prometheum. 
The crowd came to blows over viands, and the blood was spilt, and many were trampled or mauled in the stampede, some of them dwellers of the monastery. Then the warriors of the Order of the Hammer donned their flat cowls, and scribed words of praise the god emperor on their tactical visors, and went forth, ready to render service in battle. With last guns and bolters, they pierced the interlopers. With their chainswords and power flails, they struck them, and a great bloody harvest was reaped that day. But the interlopers, too, scant through their armament was, and scanter their skill in battle, slew many among the monastery's dwellers, for great were their numbers and greater their desperation. The monks fled beyond their walls and rang the vox alarm. Shut the gate. Okay, here we go. <clears throat> Quarrel broke out. The hungry and the sick lay siege of the monastery, begging for help. In their spite, they blocked the water collector and unpowered the genitorium. Faithful in the meantime made ready to resist. And a miracle came to pass. The god emperor sent his champion, his confidant, his right hand, a road trader, the blessed house von Valencius. May the light of his grace remain upon it forever. The blessed rogue trader. Summoned prelate Hectorus and the leaders of the interlopers to hold each account for their deeds. Commanded this forbidden boarding force to fall upon the interlopers. Sending a veil of protection over the interlopers. Taking them into his care and thereby all foul stone with I think I gotta do that one. Unleashed his armed force upon the interlopers and monk of the lake. <laughs> That's funny. Um... Like, I feel like I should do this. Summon the leaders. Strangers, prodigious number, beseech... Okay. Beseech the rogue trader to take them in and give them shelter and protection. Long have we wandered, swiftly, swiftly have we fled. Many a woe. Look further. Without thy holy protection we are doomed, but we fear annihilation at the hands of our kin who remain behind. For having fallen away from the sublime light of the emperor, they have descended into bloody sedition and become murderers of no misery. Uh, quoth Prelate Hectarus, ours is appearance secluded, secluded abode, by world futility we are untouched, and so we wish to remain. These unknowing souls seek to capture our abode. Okay. To be thy wish to confer land upon these wretches, confer it. Foulstone has arid land in abundance, but make it not our duty to care for them. That is not in our path. Provide that for them and provide for us, and we shall acknowledge thee as our planetary sovereign. Hmm. Yeah, send a veil of protection over the interlopers and taking them into his care and thereby all of Faustum. Humbly the order to hammer heed and the god emperor's confident and unsealed the airlocks and opened the gate of its abode and brought forth gifts of virtue to relieve the suffering of the ill streak. After a prayer the architects set to work in accordance with the sage's teachings. Uh, they are to spacious living quarters. Da -da -da -da. And a new yet righteous way of life came to Faustum and rejoiced. Oh! On certain worlds, usually the most habitable are suitable for establishing thriving colonies ripe for development. Completing the projects and colony events can earn the rogue trader unique rewards. They cannot be obtained on it. Means, projects are the backbone of colony development. Completing them requires resources that can be explained by pouring planets. Okay, so what can we build? Uh. We can do this. Cult of St. Drusius is what we take the young abode of faith under its wing. Okay. High throne. The entity lacks capital in the Cronus expanse, which guides the faith of also in the status of eternal world. The Adeptus Ministorum will assure prosperity for the new planetary stronghold. One entire will make worthier garden a sanctuary of faith in the head of that marvelous basilica. This one we get a flame web. All we get, get a, yeah. I'm not gonna give it. I'm gonna give. I said I would protect him, so I'm gonna do this one. Execute. Now what? Rank two. That's cool. I have to like come back. Oh, here's rank two. Can't do it yet, or what? Uh, you can manage your colonies remotely. Okay. That's how I do it. So when I do this, building that. 
All right, let's go somewhere else. That's kind of a cool mechanic. I like games like that where you Unless it's Starfield. Um... Start new routes. That's where it, that's a big thing. I don't want to head there yet. I want to explore. Head to Omicron. Safer. Travel. Wow, we didn't get a pop up saying something. Yep, that's super. Abelard, you bastard. So tough. Hey, what's my ship doing? Can I repair it? I. Did. Um, this does. Ah, okay. I need to find more extractum. Or whatever they're called. Maybe I do need to go. Magnetic Storm. Magnetic Storm ranging above the planet blurs the gaze of the auger rays. Only truly powerful diviner machines experience magnetic fluctuations. Their blessed vigil and discover the mysteries of this emperor forsaken planet. Leave here. They don't have some. Okay. Ruins of an ancient imperial city were discovered on a dead world. In the reports, the entire settlement is contained in a titanic glass dome that once held an artificial atmosphere. Three other cities, but for other the dome system. Um, for the local palace. Oh, I got a ghost sword. Lavishly decorated estate of local ruler. And out cruise to explore the city's end. Holy gifts. Local districts are situated. Uh, at the heart of the city, the god emperor stands your gate. Or the scouts gather many supplies possible. Beautiful. Drain the remaining fuel from the generator station. Leave the dead. Nice. But that just gave us a bunch of stuff. Oh, this is cool. Look at the shape of it. I don't have any extractors. Maybe I do need to... Let's go back. Let's try and get to our planet. Probably a better idea. Um, I go there. Have, I don't have any navigator stuff. Oh, we'll have to go. Uh, unsafe journey. I think we were okay. Beautiful. All right, let's see what's up. This is one of our home planets. Or not home planets, but protector planet. Lord Captain, according to the telemetry, the parameters of the system match those of Tychus Epsilon, home to the Agri World Janus of Bus. We have received Vox message from the planet. The Agrowards governor officially welcomes Rogue Trader and reports that she has begun preparation for formal reception. Cool. They said something bad was happening on. Cool. Hey, the genus, Janus. And look at that. Is that a big farm? Because that's cool if it is. Did the governor buy its estate? Um. I like this. Well, oh, I didn't check out the. Uh, Eldari. <laughs> that guy clapping was funny. 
Uh, ooh. Shoot. Lavishly dressed noble woman in opulent silk gown watches you with expectant air, but then gracefully bows her head. Gem encrusted implants protrude from her arm and neck. I welcome you on behalf, noble. I wish the names not so hard. On behalf of the noble house Vyat Ab Aram, my name is Vistenza Janus Vyat Ab Aram. Baronis. By the grace of the Emperor and the will of the rogue trader Theodora von Valantius, I serve a planetary go as planetary governor. And greetings to you, noble Versarian. It's been years since your last visit to Janus. I'm glad to see you again. It's a good sign when a rogue trader Seneschal does not visit a subject planet for a while. Isn't that correct, Lady Viat? It means the governor is taking care of all matters and there is no need for the Seneschal to interfere. I hear praise in those worlds and I thank you for it. In truth, your arrival at the palace place of the steam lady von lance is quite unexpected um i hope my coming in theodora's stead has not disappointed not in the least your lordship on the contrary i'm delighted after all these years to once again welcome you to for janice uh oh Ooh, a sniper got her Fighting. An example out of you. <laughs> Asia, you go here. Show them the power of the warp. See, this is starting to not be that strong. Are always drowned. And let's making nightmare. Couple of them. I am a All navigator, them, not a servitor. And be the friendly. If I may. Backline. Whatever. This dude. I'm not accustomed to being ordered around. Yeah, hey, they're not very strong. Uh, Lair. In combat with these guys. Let my enemies tremble Goody. at the sound of my steps. Okay, let's give shoot our gentle. As the Emperor commands, strike is a prayer. Of course, nothing can go well, eh? I'll do it. Phantom. Hi, momentum. Beautiful. You know what's gonna happen. We're giving it to Abelard. Abelard's gonna go nuts. Indeed. One of you at a time. My place is at the fall. Time to carry this one. At your back and call. Abelard for the win. Always, right? Worried me for a second. Oh, more people? Okay. Sniper's lighting it up, though. Avalard, you don't have cover. There. Done. Yeah. Stun grenade, damn. Hate stun grenade. To the heretics. We got a sniper too. Much damage. Okay, Argenta. Um let's get you over here. Do I will bathe people. this battlefield in righteous fury. Faith without deeds is worthless. Faith without deeds is worthless. So I'm I thinking this may be the only uh, Rogue Trader episode this week. I'm not going to kill any. I'll do it. 
Devil Lord will take him a shot at him. Okay, not bad. He's just not doing a lot of damage. Now she's in anyway. melee. Pascal. Here. This one. Now. This one. We do this and this. And we hit him with this. Running by Derek Override. Ain't not bad. Not great, but... Um, Heinrich. Get you over here to meet this advance. I need a foothold. I mean, I'm sure I'm probably using Ooh, him sweet. wrong, but... All good. Alright, then... Hit him again. I won't object. Duty. I wonder if he would be better with the two-hander. Oh. Visionist rebel. The version is rebel. The version is. Oh, you're in trouble now. Hey. Okay. Um. How can I? Can I get into there? Hey, tactically I go into there. The I hit him with this. This. I'll hit. This. Yeah. Victory is. In Duty. Then. Good charge in there. Shouldn't be allowed to, like, get an attack up. Um. We'll rule the stars and breach. Here we go. Get into these guys. Under hammer the crap. Follow my lead. <laughs> Gray hair. <laughs> sure hair. So good. What? Let me get the one attack. That was a disappointment. Okay. Oh, Cassia, Cassia, Cassia. Move. Back. Of military tactics. Oh. Steak. Adelard him done. again. Duty. Um. Need to do you. Me? If you insist, no, Captain. Yeah, I don't know how useful Casey is, to be honest. Waking nightmare. Thing. Why isn't it affecting Isn't this a job for the serfs? Ah, heritage oh, jeez. I give extra. No one. Okay. I think I'm just fighting this guy. Um. Oh, you had one health left. Come on, now. I give someone out here. Sure, let's give the estate warden extra stats. Can't just trouble. Nice. Good job, estate warden. Nice! Good work. Oh, come on now. Hey, Argenta, switch to this.
one. Hold. There's a better chance of hitting. As the hit. Emperor commands, Better, I act. Hey, um, there's no she can do. Dodged it. Hey, Pascal. Get into this guy. No attack. Hit him again. Um, that guy's weak. That. Heinrich, you should be able to get into here. I'll put my psychic abilities to use. Let's in. see to it. Nothing stands Duty. against me. Hit him again. For the throne's glory. Only terror good. smite your enemies. Good, good, good. <laughs> oh, and those poor guys got out got to deal with Abelard now. At your back and call. They're dead. Abelard, get next to the guy in case. <laughs> I've seen worse battles Proxy, than this in my uh, time. Back of opportunity. Oh, I should have charged him. I will do my duty. There you go. Keisha, you don't have much to do. Abelard's in the way, but take a shot. I should have done a named shot. There, you got. Oh. Um. Into there. For an extra attack. Hmm. I'll do it. Duty. Swing it. Actually. In him. I messed up with Cassia earlier. I should have given a person an extra turn. Nice estate warden. Good job. Way to help out. Um, wild hunt. I think I killed him slipper. I can't do that. Let's just add some damage. Faith without deeds is worthless. Ain't not bad. Not as strong as I would think a sister Baldur should be. Target I probably built her. I'm gonna still blame her. Um, here, Abelard. Or not Abelard, Pascal, sorry. Imagine being in battle and like the tech priest gets next to you and he just starts thinking. Oh, if I do this and then this. Hey, dead? Where is he? He'll be dead. Get me a target. That would be terrifying. You're like calculating how they're gonna kill you. Packed. Have our there. Isha. Get a kill. Emperor, give me strength. Beauty. Do I dare forsake my Casia for uh, that Eldari sniper if I get him? Your lordship, Emperor, preserve us, are you all right? Do not fret, lady person. We've grown used to outrageous sloth and lindness among the wardens of every world we visit. But the pale grayness is strangling this peasant like a noose. Words are laden with fear for our well-being, and yet fears for his own even. Um... I'm fine, I can't say for the same word attack. Plays the throne, if you please follow me, I will personally ask you to the governor, will you have the protection of walls and ward? 
Get on. You ran away fast, eh? Press the any key. Your Lordship, the most honorable Lair von Valantius, the governor is waiting you in her office where she is protected by walls and guards. Would you prefer to meet with her alone or with your entourage? Uh, my entourage will come. At least she has like a shield or something. Your Lordship, accept my abject apologies for the reprehensible stunt that spoiled our reception. Even my worst nightmares, I can never. Um. You can stop apologizing, I'm not offended. Thank you, Your Lordship. Believe me, I am infinitely sorry that the trouble of Janus has reached you, so even here, the most protected place on Janus. Uh, one of your warnings helped us on battle. A superb shot. Who was it? You must be referred to earlier. Our chief ally in the struggle against the rebels. I've turned a blind eye to her horrific mutations. Because uh, she's an Eldari. Given the undoubtable advantages she brings, you see, Yurlet comes from a local degenerate stock of this world and knows Janice like the back of her hand. Okay. Provide us several leads, although I admit that at times I'm tempted to send her away from the estate. Her unnaturalist means that speaking with her always leaves me on these. Did I hear you correctly, Governor Viat? You have a mysterious mutant on your estate at this very moment. One of prestigious height, slight build, with a supernatural talent for shooting. Did the arrival of this helper never give you pause for thought? Allow me to make myself killer. To review your lit's help in our circumstances would be incredibly rash. Yes, mutants are creatures abhorrent to the Emperor and they should be exterminated, but sometimes humanity makes exceptions for those who can serve the Emperor. I'm not concerned that your aid is a mutant. I'm far more concerned that she may be nothing of the sort. There, I would like to meet this helper of Governor Viat's without out of professional aid. If you wish to speak to her, you will find her outside in the orangery, most likely by the gazebo. He prefers to keep her distance from us. What's happening on the planet? Several months ago, uprisings broke out on Janus. I was not even notified at first. Griping words of her wardens worry about. Alas, I only learned what happened after miscreants began targeting noble families. And then it became apparent that what the administrat administratum's accounts had referred to as unrest were in fact organized attack on infrastructure and society leaders. They have already brought 13 agri complexes to a halt and have now moved on to assassination attempts. My wardens are doggedly tracking down rebels, but their leaders are slipping from our grasp yet again. And you fulfill its foodstuffs. I risk angering you, your lordship, but this is nothing compared to shamelessly deceiving you. Let us consider this situation dispassionately. This passionately. Even the most talented logistics expert of the administratum are unable to guarantee stable ties. And shuttles are wary of landing at a space. But we gotta fix this. Um. Serious. Uh, I'll get a bottom bottom of this. I'm sure the rebels have some. I'm immeasurably grateful you for your assistance. If any of those who attacked the estate had survived, then perhaps they could have been a valuable source of information. But you made an example of them. Incidentally, I did overhear the wardens talking about some kind of stranger in the area. Beside that, we still do not know uh, who let those reprobates into the estate. The person who did it might also know. Uh, I, as well as my retinue, are at your service. My secretary is checking the staff who speak. Okay. Who is this person standing next to you? One of my ladies in waiting, Amelia, performs secretarial duties and helps me to remain in constant contact with those families. Okay. Bathe in the light of your greatness is true honor. Would fall stations on the verse. No, yes and no, of course you can. Such an expansive as a few thousand voice rest, of course you can. We lose more provisions to gnawing past every cycle than the all could eat in their entire lives. Can we ship? Okay. Let's take my leave. Um, okay, I think that'll be it for today. That's a good place to stop it. We will solve the problems with Janice later. Thank you for joining me, everybody. This has been Teacher Plays. Class dismissed. <laughs>